Hi, my name's Gabriella. Welcome to my channel. So last year, I spent an entire year doing videos preparing for NaNoWriMo 2017. I'll put links in the descriptions if you're interested in any NaNoWriMo preparation help. And NaNoWriMo has come and gone, but I didn't want to stop talking about writing. So I've decided to start a kind of like writing chatter series or like writing and books, anything related to anything regarding those things, I guess. And uh, kind of just chat to you guys about things that I've heard or seen or read that I'm currently interested in, basically. So about a month ago, I was skiing in France. And one night we went out for dinner and we were walking back to our chalet and I just looked up and there was, it was just, we were on the side of the mountain and there was this massive mountain peak rising up in front of us on the walk back and it was kind of lit up by the moon pretty much because the lights of the village weren't quite enough to light it up and it just, it looked so amazing and it just reminded me of like a few other times when I've been skiing and I've kind of had that exact same feeling just looking up at this massive thing in front of you that's so amazing it's like a wonderful piece of nature and just feeling so inspired by it. I find that I get inspired quite a lot by nature around me. Places will often inspire different bits of story in me and these mountains it made me really just think of like high fantasy basically and yeah being in this mountain range walking back in the night and just seeing this mountain illuminated by the moon it made me feel kind of like I was almost experiencing some sort of fantasy novel that I was in it. My mind immediately went to Aragon and then obviously things like Lord of the Rings and yeah I really love high fantasy. For some reason nature inspires things in me and sometimes it makes me feel like I'm kind of in a book a bit because of just like how amazing the location is. But then every time I think of Aragon I just think of how disappointing the film adaptation was and Oh god, I'm still not over it. I'm still not over it. It's been years and years and I'm still not over it. I found that the only way I can be okay with book to film adaptations is if I've read the book once, several years before the film comes out, and before I watch the film I don't do anything to help me remember what the book was like, because that's the only way I can go into a book to film adaptation and come out pleased with the experience as opposed to usually horrified if it's awful. And it's annoying because I always want film and TV adaptations to be made of books that I love, but I usually end up hating them so, so much. Like Percy Jackson and the Lightning Thief, I could not deal with. Like, there are some bad adaptations, and then there are bad adaptations. And then going back to the things that inspire me, last night, oh my God, I just had the weirdest dream, but I think it would make a really good novel. And I really like this idea that I had when I was dreaming and I'm so tempted to kind of start planning it now as my novel for NaNoWriMo 2018. The thing is I was planning on using NaNoWriMo 2018 to rewrite my novel from 2017 and I don't know what to do anymore because this idea has quite literally popped into my head and now I really want to write it and I'm just not sure what to do because I don't feel I can just outright start writing it because it's going to be awful, I need to plan it. But if I'm planning it, then that's taking away from my time where I should be preparing my novel from last year for this year. And it's annoying as well because I sometimes have really amazing dreams and then I wake up and within like 30 seconds of waking up I've completely forgotten it all. And I'm like, that dream would make a really great novel if I could remember what had happened in it. So I'm kind of happy that I remember this dream for once, but also sad because now it means I need to make decisions. And I'm really bad at making decisions. So, um, we'll see. I'll keep you guys updated. So yeah, I guess that's kind of just like a quick short video of some stuff that I've been thinking about recently that's kind of writing and book related. Let me know if you like it or if you've got any points to add to any of the things that I've been discussing. It hasn't really been very structured or anything. It's kind of just been me rambling and so we'll see how that ends up. But um, maybe I'll try and make like more structured ones in the future. Yeah, we'll just see how this goes. Get some writing chatter started. Make sure to subscribe to stay updated when the next videos come out. See you next time. Bye.